As you work through your AutoCAD electrical project, you will need to audit both the drawing and do an electrical audit of all of your components and wires. Now, what we'll do first, as usual, is we'll make sure that our current drawing, which is a general electrical audit and drawing audit drawing. So what we'll do, we'll add that to the project, add the active drawing like we've done before and apply the project default values. Always do this. It's just really good CAD practice, good habit to get into, change the properties there. Sheet value needs to change to four because it's sequential and it adds it to the project drawing list like so. Now, to create your drawing audit and your electrical audit, we go to the reports tab on the ribbon and there's electrical and there's drawing. So let's do a drawing audit first. It's prompting us, do we want to audit the drawing or the project? Now, I don't want to do the project because there's four drawings there. It'll give us loads of data. Let's just do the active drawing for now and I'll OK that. The drawing audit itself, there's five options. So as you can see, wire gap pointers, bogus wire, zero length wires, wire number floaters, and show wires mark in red. It's a bit like a regular AutoCAD drawing audit, but with specific electrical settings this time. So I click on OK, and as you can see, it's processing down here on the command line. It will chug through that now, working through and checking. Now, the nice thing is here, the drawing audit tells me that I have 36 line entities, 36 wires on normal wire layers shown in red, as you can see, zero wires on no wire numbering. So that means that all my wires are in the right place on the right layers. If I OK that, there's my listing there. It tells me that everything's OK. Time and date of audit. I can save that as a particular report file you can see that there or what i can do i'll just cancel that i can just print that out if i want to as well i'm just going to close it in this case now you'll notice that the thick red lines are still there what i can do is go to the command line or use dynamic input and type regen that will regenerate the drawing it takes a few seconds to update and you'll see we're back to our normal line widths again so that's doing a drawing audit in autocad electrical Let's do an electrical audit now. Now you'll see it update, it goes through the project. I'm just gonna drag that dialogue down into the middle like that. And you can see it's looking at the project file, the WDP file, or I can look at the active drawing. So in the project itself, in all of these four drawings, I've got 201 errors. And if I go to details there, you can see unconnected wires, wire exception errors. You can see it's things like missing wire numbers that I haven't done in any detail. You would do this if you were doing it professionally, obviously. Things like components without a connection at the moment. The motors don't have connections. Components don't have a catalog number, for example. So there's a component with no bill of material part assignment, for example. So these are things that you need to check. Now, I'm just going to close that electrical audit down and I'll run it again, again, errors found but let's go to active drawing now i'll just drag that down here a bit so we can see it again 56 errors this time and you'll see on this particular drawing we've got unconnected wires duplicated terminal numbers and so on and so forth so they're very simple errors that have come up in the electrical audit and the whole idea of this is if you get a drawing from somebody else you can immediately run a drawing audit and an electrical audit to check that all of this is correct more importantly, it also acts as a sanity check for you when you're creating your own electrical drawings as well. Notice you can go to, you can save as, save all and print at the bottom there. If I just want to hide the details, I can do that again, and I can click on close to close the dialogue itself. So you can see that it's very easy to run these reports right here. So that's electrical audit and drawing audit in AutoCAD Electrical for your project or your active drawing.